together, as we said, uh, the mapping of how any relationship goes. And it starts with ideally your perfect relationship. And uh, in this, you're in love and you're in bliss and joy. But after a little while, what happens? You get go into a little doubt. You start doubting your relationship. Um, am I, you know, does this person like me? Does this person love me? Does my mother love me? Uh, you know, all of these things. And we start going into this doubt of about a person. And then obviously we're human beings. So we don't believe, you know, like, no, it can't be true. My mother loves me. My father loves me. It can't be true. So we go into a denial mode. And then after a denial mode, the suspicious mode, you know, starts hitting you where basically you start looking for synchronities. Are they, you know, what's happening with them? What are they doing? Are they telling me the truth? And then basically you get into a lie, cheating, betrayal. So as we see that, you know, lies, cheating and betrayal doesn't have to be, um, you know, always with the other person. Like for Margarita, she actually felt that she cheated herself by, you know, saying, I, I, I didn't step up. I didn't attend. What did I do? I said no. Uh, but she really wanted to say yes. But so now she felt, you know, betrayed herself. She cheated herself. And maybe, you know, felt that she lied to herself that I love my grandmother more than my mother. And then now you do the fight, the, the internal fight or the external fight. So, you know, in both the cases, you start confronting or you have the confusion about the truth. And after that, you go into rage, anger and hate. Okay. So I'm angry. Now I'm going to make my life or your anybody else's life hell. And then you go into the fear and the shame. So what happens is, um, you know, you start losing, you know, love. You start losing. You start drifting apart. You start separation. But then obviously, you know, we go back to like, no, I want to forgive. I want to hold it together. Let's work it out for our sake, yeah, other, other sake, whatever. And you give yourself a second chance. And by that second chance, you basically then start to say, can I make it? Can I make it? Can I make it? And then eventually you do separation or you live a separate life. And eventually it's breakup and divorce. So all of this applies to self, person, parent, child. And what we've done is we've given a life view. So uh, exactly what I've explained. And all of the processes are taken from my deck of healing cards, which is, as I said, I've uh, channeled them, the art is mine, everything. Uh, and they're available also for purchase. Um, and you can do the processes. Uh, they're very easy processes. As I've explained, we explained already to Keisha and Margarita. Uh, so that you can do the processes as given, very simple. And then that can start changing and you can start to begin a journey of self-healing and internal introspection. So to putting that in a nutshell.